one of the top videos on the YouTube channel is Hulk Hogan arm wrestling Andre the Giant. And My company. You've got to you've got to tell us the whole story of booking it, and I suppose uh, people love to hear like stories of a younger Andre and a really young Hulk at the same time. Right. Yeah, that was my company, Southeastern, uh, down there in the Gulf Coast. And uh, and uh, uh, Hulk was super green, man. Uh, he couldn't he couldn't work worth the shit. In fact, I went down to <laughs> Louis Toilette. You know Louis? Louis oh, Toulette. I know him. Louis Toilette uh, called me up, and I had him booking down there. And he says, Ron, I found this guy in Tampa. He goes, he's a big son of a bitch, man. He says, but he, he can't work. He's not too good in the ring, you know. Uh, and he says, uh, can you come down to work with him? So I came down, uh, you know, I worked about, uh, I probably worked for two months, night after night, lots of, uh, probably three times a week with Hoga, trying to teach him, trying to trying to let him to get a feel for for the business. And uh, so uh, then uh, Louis comes to me and he says, Ron, I, I got a great angle. I got a great angle. Well, let's get Andre in here. And uh, so uh, Andre came down. Andre had never met him. This is the first time these two guys ever saw themselves, right? The, you know, and uh, so, uh, and I was at the deal. Louis, Louis brought me to his house. He brought uh, Andre into his house. He brought Andre a day early, as a matter of fact. And then he brought Hulk in. And uh, we sat there and, uh, and they introduced those two guys. And they talked. And uh, obviously, you know, uh, Andre loved him. Right off the bat, God, he's, he's he's the only guy I can ever work with. He knew that right away. You know, he was like, God, Louis, you're right. You know, you told me right, Louis. Uh, he he's the guy. He's for me, man. And, you know, and uh, so uh, you know, we worked a little angle on TV, uh, and you probably saw that. You've seen it, I guess. Mm -hmm. Obviously, Jake. Yeah. So uh, you know, uh, James. Uh, so it, uh, it it's a pretty good little angle. I mean, it worked it worked pretty good. But you could see how Green Hulk was in the in the angle. You know, he had Andre going a little bit. Andre got juice for him the whole deal. Yeah, you know, I'd never seen Andre get blood for anybody. I was like, some bitch, Andre. You could go that far? Hell yeah, yeah. I'm gonna, I like the guy. I want to see what he can do. You know. And uh, so he got the juice, and uh, and then Hulk pounded on him a little bit, and then he ran and got out of the ring. And uh, and Billy Spears was his manager. And Spears says, "Get in there. Where? Get your fuck. Go get him, God." Andre still kind of bent over in the corner and waiting on him, right, to get to come get more heat. And uh, you know, so uh, it was it was a hell of a little angle, man. And uh, that's where those guys got together. And uh, so that's how it's on, oh, that's that's there. On, it's on tape, huh? Oh yeah. Yeah, it's on my it's on my on my channel on my streaming. I channel. gotta I I gotta check no. it out. Yeah, but uh, see, yeah. that's one of the that's one of the gems that people don't know. And where is this again? Yeah, this was in it, it was in Dothan's TV, Dothan, Alabama. On Dothan's yeah, but TV. Where, can, where can we find it online? A uh, classic continental wrestling. Classic continental wrestling dot com. Yeah, got it. And uh, Got and then uh, and then I have his first uh, Hulk's first television match uh, with a green kid, you know, and Hulk's green as shit too. You can tell once you watch the match, you know. Uh, <laughs> uh, that's the only footage. No, they, no telling what the, that footage. The rest of that footage, he come. I have I brought in guys. We brought in guys to work with him, man, from all over. Big name dudes, man. Uh, some of them not so good. Uh, I got to tell you, one of these matches, Dutch, and you can imagine just from listening to the two of these guys. Uh, can you imagine watching a match with him and Ox Baker? Good God. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Slapping his hands. Ah. I mean, uh, there's some, there would have to be some classic matches, man. That we, Did, do you have we, that match? Huh? I don't have, have that the, match. No. Uh, I only have two Hulk matches of all the time that he, he worked for me probably the first uh, six months of his career. Mm. And, uh, and uh, then he went to, went to, went to New York pretty quickly after that. He went from me into Memphis for a little short run in Memphis. And then he went to Georgia and. Uh, Minneapolis, and then, wasn't it? Huh? Then he go to Minneapolis for, for New York. Yeah, I think he goes there after he goes up. He gets his shot into New York because uh, he worked for me. I, this was from uh, May of 1979 up to about the middle of uh, 
July of 1979. Then he went to Memphis. Then he went into Georgia. And I sold my territory to uh, Jim Barnett out of Atlanta. Yeah. And so then Barnett asked me on Thanksgiving in 1979 if I would work with the Hulk in Knoxville. And uh, so he put me over. And and they and they and uh, the finish was that they told him uh, that they wanted uh, him to go over. And Hulk says, "Ron, you, you've been so good to me, man. You you taught me so much." He goes, "I don't want to beat you in this town. He goes, this is your town. You built this town. It was, you know, I know your history here." He said, uh, I, "I want you to beat me, you know." So we figured a finish where I beat him. Uh, so kind of a God deal. And then he went from there. He says, Ron, next week, I'm going to New York. I'm going to work for, for McMahon Sr. Mm -hmm. And then he worked there a short period of time. Sr. didn't like him. Sr. didn't like him. He went to Minneapolis. And then uh, so, he went, so he went to New York. I mean, he went to New York a short period of time before he went to Minneapolis. Then he yeah. got over to Minneapolis. He got over in Minneapolis. He got his shit together. And then uh, Vince Jr. was the guy that was hot for him. Vince mm -hmm. Jr. liked him. Senior didn't like him. Junior liked him. Junior heard what went on over there in uh, Vern's territory. And he said, oh, I got to get this guy back. Um, a lot of history yeah. there, man. Uh, it is a lot of history there.